I'm Lucy Kraft Langley. I was born April 13th, 1854 in Macon, Georgia, the daughter of a former slave. My father was a Presbyterian minister and a skilled carpenter. My mother taught me how to read at an early age. I love to read books. I would always say when I grow up, I want to be a teacher. At the age of 15, I enrolled in Atlanta University and I studied extremely hard because I wanted to become a teacher. In 1873, I graduated and became that teacher. I worked with my students. I did the best that I could to help them to fulfill their dreams. And 10 years later, 10 years later, in 1883, guess what? I opened my own school. This was the first black school in the South. The end of the second year, there were more than 200 African-American students enrolled in the school. This was the first school that also offered kindergarten classes. I also taught training and I opened up a school that would train nurses. I worked hard with our black children, helping them to become the best of who they could be. I was a pioneer in the field of education. I paved the way for great educational leaders, including Mary Bethune and Charlotte Hemp Hawkins Brown. I just motivated our children to become the best they could be. I wanted them to fulfill their goals. I would tell them, when your friends tell you that it can't be done, that it's too hard or it's no use of trying, I would just tell them to grab hold of faith and trust and to never give up. I would tell them that life is like a journey. The road gets dark, rough and rugged. There are many hard turns and some dead ends. I tell them that you may have to detour once or maybe twice, but it's okay. Just grab hold of faith and trust and never give up. I wanted them to keep traveling and hold on until you fulfilled your destiny. And I died October the 23rd, 1933, and my legacy lives on.